Hello guys, how are you? Welcome back to our channel mrchrono.ro from Mr. Chrono. My name is Roshu Horia and today I want to present you our two watches we have in stock and also a small comparison between the Black Bay 58 and also the Black Bay GMT Pro. Uh, the Black Bay 58 we had it until, until now in stock, we sold it many times but the Pro we had it only once and we sold it on order. So today I will present you the watches and at the end please tell me a feedback, a review, which one do you like the most, which one uh, will you buy as your first entry level luxury watch, the Black Bay 58 or the Two Door GMT Pro. Before I present you the watches I just want to thank you, thank you to all our customers who bought from us in 2022. Uh, we had an amazing month in December and also a great year. I just want to thank you for believing in our brand, believing in our watches and in what we sell and also believing in our customer service. So thank you guys again and uh, now let's uh, move on and let me show you the watches. So guys, let me show you both watches, the Black Bay 58 and the Tudor Pro. So the watches comes also obviously with full set box and papers. Here you have the model, the warranty card, the booklets. Uh, this is normally a synthetic, synthetic leather and this is from wood, the box for the watch. You have here the other small compartment. If you have, for example, the white tag and if you have the, the bracelet sized, you can put over, over there. So first, the Black Bay Pro. The watch is fully stickered. It has even the QR code. And the other one, the second watch, the Black Bay 58. The same full set. Here you have the serial, the reference number, and the booklets. Both watches are from 2022. Uh, and also this one is fully stickered the QR code and here the other compartment uh, both watches did for, for this time did not get the white tag but they are all unsized and unworn so guys now we have them both side to side so with the black bay 58 the case size is 39 millimeters, the same like the Pro, but the thickness of the Black Bay 58 is 11.7 millimeters, and the thickness of the Black of the Black Bay GMT Pro is 14.6 millimeters. If you have a bigger wrist, I think the Pro is not a problem for you. Also, the lug width, the Black Bay 58 has 20 uh, millimeters. And the Black Bay 50, the Black Bay uh, GMT Pro has the same 20 millimeters. Uh, both are uh, have 200 meters water resistance, and they have both a uh, two-door in-house movement. On the Black Bay 58, the iconic MT5402, and on the two-door Pro, you have the movement MT5652. And because the Black Bay 58 has a black bezel, not stainless steel bezel, it's from aluminium, visually it looks smaller than the Black Bay GMT Pro. If you put it like this, one close to another. What I like new, they uh, put on the Tudor Pro, the new T-Fit clasp that was originally put on the Tudor Bronze. So with this one, you can adjust it to maximum one millim one centimeters if you want to wear it in the summer and uh, it's too fixed on your wrist you just put try like this and you move it and uh, it goes inside approximately approximately one one centimeter so it's very conveniently if you want to wear the watch bigger or smaller on your wrist this way you can adjust it with no problems you do not need to take uh, link out from the bracelet and also what i like about this new bracelet and the new clasp the fold the fold clasp here it's fixed it's not like the black bay 58 
where even if you do not wear it once or twice, it will get here hair lines from the how it's made the clasp, the configuration. So this one looks better, looks uh, even nicer on the bracelet, on the Pro. Also on the movement inside the watch, the Caliber MT5652. So uh, in this position, you wind the watch. In the second position, you can change the date. The date changes instantly, like on the Rolex watches. And the cool thing is that with this movement, you can go backwards if you want with the date, not only forwards. So this one also has the GMT complication and a date. And the simple and iconic Black Bay 58 has just the hour and the minutes and the seconds. So uh, between them, uh, if for example, my opinion, if I want to buy my first watch, I will go with this one, the Black Bay 58. Yeah, yes, I know it's hyped in the market. Everybody has it and now everybody wants to sell it. But as an entry level watch, the Black Bay 58, I think it's more perfect for your wrist. And if you want just a simple watch, because if you want to go to a business meeting or if you want to go to a dinner with this watch, it's simple to set the date. Let me show you. With this one, it's simple to, to set the date. You just go forwards and put like this and that's it. You screw down the crown. But on the Pro, if, you're not, if you did not wear it for two or three days, you have to adjust the time, the date and everything. And uh, I think if you want simple things and you don't have a lot of time, you want simple, uh, the Black Bay 58, it's a perfect choice. The Pro, normally I will buy it as a second uh, watch in my collection or if I, if I like a bigger uh, watch on my wrist. A chunkier one, but again, being 39 millimeters looks awesome, looks great. Not being 41 like the Pepsi. So guys, that was it for today. Thank you for watching. Uh, please comment below. Which one of these two watches uh, will, you, will you buy as your first entry level luxury watch? The Black Bay, the Tudor Pro or the Black Bay 58? Uh, normally, like I said before, I will buy the Black Bay 58, but even the thickness of the Pro, it's not bad. I had uh, a used Tudor Chrono Panda. I sold it. We sold it from the company. Uh, I put it on my wrist and I liked the thickness and the size of the Chrono even though it's uh, bigger than the Pro. Uh, so uh, thank you again for watching. If you want to buy this one of these watches, send us a message like usually on the Facebook page, uh, Instagram or on WhatsApp. And if you liked uh, our content, content, please like, subscribe and share this video with somebody who likes watches. Thank you guys again. My name is Roshu Horia and see you next time with other watches we will have in stock.